everyone. Welcome back from the break. My name is Kristen McAllister, and I'm here today to give you all the information that you need to know about the weather that we have in Fort Collins and around Colorado. So, what is it looking like right outside now? We are sitting at 7 degrees currently, pretty chilly. I mean, not much different than the whole rest of the day today, but still a little bit cold. We also do have a wind, a wind chill advisory from the National Weather Service. This does mean that it can have wind chills as low as 25 degrees below zero, so pretty cold. Right now we do only have a wind chill of about three degrees, so that essentially means that it feels about three degrees outside instead of our lovely seven degrees. There is also a 30 minute frostbite time. This just means that if you're outside and you have exposed skin, you can get frostbite on those exposed areas within 30 minutes. So I definitely recommend bundling up if you're trying to go outside so that you can avoid getting a little bit frostbite. And what did the weather look like today? Well, it was rather overcast. Uh, you can see those clouds filling up the entire sky. It just was pretty gloomy throughout the day. Also brought in some wind that didn't really help anything in temperature wise. There's some soggy snow on the ground that melted, but luckily those snow blowers were coming through to clear the road as students were walking to and from classes. And tonight, it's not gonna be getting any warmer. We're going to start at one degree in Fort Collins as our low. As we move down the I-25 corridor, warming up a little bit at four degrees in Denver, but reaching the negatives in Colorado Spring and just slightly warmer than us in, Col in Fort Collins, down in Pueblo at two degrees. We do hit the state low in Craig at zero degrees, as well as the state high in 30 degrees in Grand Junction. And as we look onto the other side of the state, hitting all negatives for the east, which is, I'm, I'm just really glad we're not sitting over there. And as we look into what the weather is going to be like tomorrow, luckily we're going to be warming up a little bit more than these overnight lows. 12 degrees in Fort Collins, a little bit warmer in Denver, hitting 16 degrees in Colorado Springs, and then the low, the warmer temperature, excuse me, in 23 degrees in Pueblo. As you can see, Vail, Colorado Springs, and Telluride are all indicated in red. This does mean that they have received a winter storm warning, which does come from the National Weather Service, stating that these areas will receive more than four inches of snow within 12 hours. Pretty crazy, so I'm just glad that Fort Collins doesn't have one of those advisories. And it is going to warm up a little bit in Grand Junction at 39 degrees. Same thing down in Alamosa. And as we move to the other side of the state, sitting in the teens for the most part, except we are going to reach 26 degrees in Lamar. And for tomorrow, I don't know if anyone is hoping for a snow day. I know I am, but unfortunately, we are not going to get to those temperatures that would, uh, that would allow for a snow day, unfortunately. We are going to be at 12 degrees, as I had just said, a three degree low. We are going to have some scattered showers, excuse me, some scattered snow showers throughout the day with some winds coming in from the east southeast at 10 to 12 miles per hour. So that will kind of be a little bit chilly. Definitely, I'm going to be out with my hat and my gloves probably as well. We do have a 50% chance of snow, not anything too crazy. And if we do get some snowfall, it will only accumulate to about an inch. So really, looks like we're going to be class in session tomorrow. But luckily, we will be warming up a little bit throughout the week. On Thursday, 22 degrees warming up a little bit, 10 degrees warmer than Wednesday. Friday warming up even more, 29 degrees with a four degree low. And as we move into our weekend, even warmer at 38 degrees on Saturday, 48 degrees on Sunday. I personally am looking forward to that. My mom is currently in Austin, Texas. They have 85 degrees right there. I'm not upset about it, but we'll just be chilling here in the cold, literally chilling. And I'll just bring my hot chocolate so it'll be fine. Sorry, mom. Anyway, that is all the weather that I have for you, but stay tuned after the break because Ren and Kenny will be back with some more news. 